Hello, good morning and happy Saturday. We're in for a beautiful weekend across the region. High temperatures pushing into the low to mid 70s. We will get a couple of cooler readings, especially in our eastern counties. And then overnight staying far above our average as we drop back down into the lower 50s. Looking ahead through our wind gusts today and tomorrow, they could exceed 30 miles an hour at times. So a little breezy, if not windy, and we'll see that wind coming in from the south, which is going to help warm up our temperatures even more as we head into tomorrow and Monday. But with the high winds and the low humidity that does introduce an increased fire threat this weekend, try to keep outdoor burning to a minimum or at least in a very controlled environment as this recipe is perfect to spread fires. Now the next couple of days will be warmer with high temperatures nearing 80 degrees on Sunday. We could see some record highs broken or tied. And then Monday, a little bit cooler because of the cloud cover, but still very warm before a cold front brings us a chance for storms late Monday night and into Tuesday morning. Now the Storm Prediction Center has outlined a level one severe threat for some of our far southern counties. And in this area, we could see some high wind gusts as well as some hail in the strongest storms. But overall, not completely sold on these rain chances. I think it's going to be a lot less than what you're seeing on future cast. We'll just see a chance for some scattered storms, primarily east of Highway 65 and south of I-44. And then those chances will clear out by the Tuesday morning commute. We're looking at additional rain chances through the week the highest rain chances likely Thursday and into Friday as higher moisture starts to return. Now ahead of that, I think the rain chances are going to be very hit or miss. We could see a couple of showers Tuesday and Wednesday, but here's a look at how dry that air mass is going to be. Overall, not a lot for the rain to work with, but we will see that higher moisture make a return by next weekend, leading to those higher rain chances and cooler air with highs in the 60s on Thursday and the upper 50s on Friday.